Yung kay President Bongbong Marcos, his target really is the economic provisions of the Constitution. So why is it urgent? Because government cannot pay for everything. We need the private sector. And the domestic private sector is limited in funds. And that's why we need to amend the Constitution so we can attract foreign investors. I think that is really the, the drive of our president. We have already, we're heavily indebted because of the COVID years. And we want to bring in investors. We want to bring in foreign funds. Foreign funds will lead to job creation. Foreign funds will lead to better services. But we have an obstacle, and that is our 1987 constitution. That's what President Bongbong Marcos is concerned about. And he wants to relieve the Filipino people of the burden of having a hard time finding a job. Kailangan mag abroad pa, kayo, pa tayo, uh, just to get decent wages. So I, ako, I see that the, this is a good movement forward in part of the administration. And everything has its political challenges. And it really, like what you said, yung mga followers, yung, the general people, they need to understand why this is urgent. This is not about what says yung, um, yung mga hearsays na you amend the constitution, prolong yung mga term limits, babalik si, si, you know, si uh, president for another turn, or maging prime minister, si speaker. All of that is garbage. It's very simple, economic provisions. Let's start the debate already and let's be as transparent as possible so the Filipino people will not doubt their legislators.